The expanse of ocean, which spans more than 70% of our planet's surface, conceals an array of enigmas that captivate our imagination and fuel our desire for discovery. Even with all the scientific progress we've made, there's still so much left to uncover beneath the waves. In this video, the Shin will take you on a journey through some of the ocean's most fascinating revelations. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to help support our exploration. The wreck of the Titanic stands as a haunting window into one of the most tragic events in history. On the fateful night of April 14, 1912, the Titanic, often hailed as the unsinkable ship, met its doom during its maiden voyage from Southampton to New York. It collided with an iceberg in the freezing waters of the North Atlantic. By the early hours of April 15th, the ship had sunk, claiming the lives of over 1,500 of the 2,200 passengers and crew on board. This disaster left a profound scar on maritime history and human memory, becoming a solemn reminder of human ambition and nature's unpredictable power. Fast forward to 1985, decades after the sinking, when the Titanic's wreckage was finally discovered on the ocean floor, lying 3,800 meters deep. This groundbreaking achievement was made possible through cutting-edge submersibles and sonar technology. The ship's bow, eerily well-preserved, stood in stark contrast to the crumpled stern, bearing the marks of its violent descent. Personal belongings like luggage, shoes, and kitchenware, emblazoned with the Titanic's logo, were recovered, providing a poignant connection to the lives lost that night. This discovery not only helped uncover the tragic events that led to the Titanic's sinking, but also revolutionized the field of underwater archaeology. The artifacts recovered from the wreck are now displayed in museums, preserving the memory of this catastrophe and continuing to inspire exploration of the ocean's depths. If you're new to our channel, The Shin warmly welcomes you. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and make sure to turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our upcoming content. Heracleion, the lost city of the gods. Heracleion, also known as Thonis in ancient records, was a legendary Egyptian city famed for its cultural, religious, and economic significance. Over 2,000 years ago, it flourished as a vital port that connected Egypt to the Mediterranean world. Beyond being a bustling trade hub, it was a sacred site dedicated to the Kuada moon and other deities, where grand ceremonies and rituals were held. Heraclean's splendor was said to rival the greatest cities of its time, featuring towering temples, lively marketplaces, and a harbor brimming with activity. Yet for centuries, this jewel of antiquity remained lost beneath the waves, its existence enveloped in myth and mystery. In 2000, a groundbreaking underwater expedition led by Frank Gaudio uncovered the remains of the city near the mouth of the Nile. Using state-of-the-art sonar and magnetometry, archaeologists brought Heracleion back to the surface. Among the discoveries were colossal stone statues, some standing over five meters tall, as if guarding the secrets of the past, intricately carved temple pillars, gold-adorned jewelry, coins, and religious artifacts emerged from the seabed, remarkably preserved under layers of silt and sediment. These artifacts offer an unparalleled glimpse into ancient Egyptian civilization, shedding light on the city's architectural and artistic brilliance, as well as its role in regional politics and international trade. Geologists speculate that Heracleion was swallowed by the sea due to a combination of natural disasters, including earthquakes, tsunamis, and rising sea levels. The rediscovery of this lost city is not only an archaeological triumph, but a poignant reminder of nature's power to reshape history. As researchers continue to study its submerged remains, Heracleion serves as a window into a world of forgotten grandeur, inviting us to reflect on the fleeting nature of human achievements. The Bimini Road, a pathway to the mythical Atlantis. In 1968, a group of divers exploring the crystal clear waters off Bimini Island in the Bahamas made an extraordinary discovery, a series of massive limestone blocks lying in a linear formation on the seabed known as the Bimini Road. Stretching approximately 800 meters, the arrangement of these blocks with their orderly alignment and rectangular shape sparked decades of speculation and intrigue. The discovery immediately captivated the public's imagination, with some theorists connecting it to the legendary city of Atlantis. According to Plato, Atlantis was an advanced civilization that was swallowed by the sea after a catastrophic flood. Advocates of this theory suggest that the Bimini Road could be the remnants of an ancient harbor, a ceremonial causeway, or even part of a once sophisticated city lost to time and rising sea levels. They point to the formation's symmetry and the large flat stones as evidence of advanced engineering, implying that its creators possessed knowledge far beyond what was previously believed possible for ancient societies. However, skeptics 
argue that the Bimini Road is simply a natural geological formation. They attribute its seemingly man-made appearance to sedimentary processes, erosion, and the region's unique seabed characteristics suggesting that the blocks are a coincidence of nature shaped by the movement of water and sand over millennia. Despite numerous scientific investigations, the true nature of the Bimini Road remains a mystery. This enduring enigma has not only reignited interest in the legend of Atlantis, but also inspired new explorations into the depths of the ocean in search of other possible connections between myth and history. Whether it is a natural phenomenon or a man-made marvel, the Bimini Road continues to intrigue archaeologists, geologists, and adventurers. It stands as a testament to humanity's unyielding curiosity and serves as a reminder of how much the ocean still holds from the distant past. The Yonaguni Monument, Japan's Enigmatic Submerged Pyramid Beneath the waters off the southern coast of Yonaguni Island in Japan lies one of the most controversial underwater discoveries of modern times. In 1986, divers stumbled upon a massive stone structure resembling a stepped pyramid at a depth of 25 meters. Known as the Yonaguni Monument, this formation features broad terraces, sharp angles, and distinct geometric patterns that have perplexed researchers for decades. Some scientists argue that natural processes, including tectonic shifts, ocean currents, and erosion, shaped the monument over thousands of years. They point to similar formations around the world, where nature has created shapes that appear man-made. However, many researchers and enthusiasts challenge this theory, highlighting features such as staircase-like formations, platforms, and what seem to be carvings in an altar as evidence of human craftsmanship. If human-made, the structure could date back to the last ice age, over 10,000 years ago, when lower sea levels may have left the area above water. The monument's purpose remains a subject of much speculation. Some believe it may have been a ceremonial or religious site, while others suggest it could have been a fortress or in an early example of urban planning. If it is proven to be man-made, it would challenge our current understanding of early civilizations and their capabilities, potentially, potentially rewriting the narrative of ancient human ingenuity. Regardless of its origins, the Yonaguni Monument remains a captivating mystery standing as a symbol of the enigmatic nature of the underwater world and urging us to continue exploring and expanding the boundaries of our historical knowledge. USS Indianapolis, a wartime tragedy remembered. The story of the USS Indianapolis is a haunting account of courage, tragedy, and survival. On July 30th, 1945, just days after delivering critical components for the atomic bomb to Tinian Island, a mission so secretive that even its crew was unaware of its true purpose, the ship was struck by torpedoes from a Japanese submarine in the Philippine Sea. The heavy cruiser sank in just 12 minutes, sending over 880 of its 1,199 crew members into, uh, into the water with little time to prepare for survival. Those who survived the initial sinking endured four harrowing days adrift in the open ocean without lifeboats or adequate supplies. The men fought against dehydration, starvation, and the scorching sun, while the waters were infested with oceanic white-tipped sharks that claimed the lives of many. By the time rescue arrived, only 316 men remained alive. For decades, the ship's final resting place remained a mystery, symbolizing one of the deadliest disasters in U.S. naval history. In 2017, after years of searching, a team led by Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen discovered the wreck of the USS Indianapolis at a depth of 5,500 meters in the Pacific Ocean. The site revealed haunting remnants of the ship, including its cannons, shattered hull, and personal artifacts left behind by the crew. The discovery brought closure to a long-standing mystery and honored the memory of those who served aboard the ship. It provided historians and researchers with valuable insights into the perils of wartime missions and the extraordinary resilience of those who faced unimaginable odds. The story of the USS Indianapolis continues to resonate as a poignant reminder of the sacrifices made during World War II and the enduring spirit of those who serve in times of war. The Kraken myth meets science. For centuries, sailors have been haunted by tales of the Kraken, a monstrous sea creature with massive tentacles capable of dragging entire ships to their doom. These stories, passed down through generations, were often dismissed as exaggerated maritime folklore or the fanciful accounts of frightened crews. The Kraken became a symbol of the unknown dangers lurking beneath the waves, securing its place in legend and literature. However, in 2004, 
the line between myth and reality began to blur when Japanese researchers captured the first ever footage of a giant squid in its natural habitat. This elusive deep sea giant, which can grow up to 13 meters long, brought to life the essence of the Kraken legend. With its enormous muscular tentacles lined with suction cups and sharp hooks, the giant squid is a formidable predator, capable of capturing and subduing large prey with startling efficiency. These creatures inhabit the twilight zone of the ocean, a realm so deep that sunlight barely reaches. Their enormous eyes, among the largest in the animal kingdom, are highly adapted to detect faint light and movement, enabling them to navigate and hunt in near total darkness. Despite their imposing size and predatory prowess, much about the giant squid remains a mystery. Ongoing research into their biology and behavior has uncovered fascinating details about their role in the deep sea ecosystem. As apex predators, giant squids play a crucial role in maintaining the balance of the food web. Their ability to withstand immense underwater pressures and their elusive nature make them a captivating subject for marine biologists, serving as a reminder of how little we know about the deep ocean. The discovery of the giant squid has sparked renewed interest in exploring the ocean's depths raising the question of what other mythical creatures or undiscovered species may lie beneath the waves. The transformation of the Kraken, from legend to reality, highlights the vast and mysterious nature of the ocean, where fact and fiction often collide. This revelation challenges us to continue our exploration of the deep sea, where every new discovery brings humanity closer to unlocking the secrets of a world that remains largely uncharted and teeming with wonders. As science advances, the ocean's myths and mysteries continue to inspire fascination and wonder. Sunken Treasures, Gems of the Ocean's Depths The ocean, often described as a vast and enigmatic underwater museum, holds countless treasures hidden beneath its waves. These lost riches, the products of shipwrecks, piracy, and natural disasters, tell stories of exploration, conflict, and ambition from centuries past. Among the most iconic finds, is the Spanish treasure galleon Nuestra Señora de Atocha, which sank in 1622. This magnificent ship was part of a fleet transporting immense wealth from the Americas to Spain, laden with gold coins, silver ingots, and emerald-studded jewelry. The Atocha met its tragic fate during a hurricane off the coast of Florida, the storm scattering the fleet and sending the Atocha to the ocean floor, along with its crew and cargo, creating one of the most significant maritime disasters of the colonial era. For centuries, the wreck remained undisturbed, shrouded in mystery, until it was rediscovered in 1985 by renowned treasure hunter Mel Fisher. The recovery was nothing short of extraordinary. Over 180,000 gold and silver coins, gleaming emerald jewelry, religious artifacts, and intricately crafted gold items were brought to the surface. These treasures, valued at billions of dollars, offered a vivid snapshot of the wealth and opulence that characterized Spain's colonial enterprise. Beyond their monetary value, these artifacts provide crucial insights into the dynamics of the colonial era. They illuminate the vast economic networks of the time, highlighting the extraction of resources from the Americas, the risks of maritime trade, and the technological advancements in shipbuilding and navigation. However, the discovery of sunken treasures often ignites legal disputes. Governments, private salvagers, and cultural heritage organizations frequently clash over ownership, raising ethical questions about preserving history versus profiting from it. Should such treasures belong to the nations that claim historical ties to them, or do they belong to the explorers who risked everything to recover them? Despite these controversies, the allure of sunken treasures continues to inspire adventurers, historians, and archaeologists alike. Each discovery offers a glimpse into a bygone world and underscores the ocean's role as a guardian of history. These finds remind us of the enduring power of the sea to preserve its secrets, waiting patiently for those daring enough to uncover them. The story of the Atocha and similar shipwrecks captivates the imagination, blending tales of danger, fortune, and discovery. As technology advances, new underwater exploration tools promise to reveal even more hidden treasures, offering tantalizing glimpses into the mysteries of our shared past. Cold War Relics – Secrets of Underwater Spycraft The Cold War, a period of intense geopolitical tension between global superpowers, was marked by a race for dominance not only on land, and in the skies, but also in the depths of the ocean. This technological and intelligence battle gave rise to some of the most advanced and secretive innovations of the time. In 2016, explorers uncovered one such relic of this clandestine underwater race, a titanium robotic submarine 
quietly resting off the coast of the United States. This submersible, a marvel of engineering for its era, was equipped with advanced cameras, propulsion systems, and sophisticated sensors, enabling it to carry out covert operations deep beneath the waves. Designed to evade detection, these submarines played a crucial role in intelligence gathering missions. They were used to map the ocean floor, monitor enemy movements, intercept underwater communications, and even recover sensitive materials from the seabed. The robust titanium construction allowed the vessel to withstand the crushing pressures of the deep ocean, showcasing the ingenuity and determination of Cold War engineers and scientists. These vessels symbolize the hidden battles of the Cold War, silent struggles fought in the dark, far removed from public view. The discovery of this robotic submarine offers a rare opportunity to peer into this secretive world. It sheds light on the extraordinary lengths nations went to in order to gain a strategic advantage, developing technologies that would later influence advancements in oceanography, marine exploration, and modern submersibles. As researchers study these relics, they unravel tales of espionage and technological competition that shaped the global landscape of the 20th century. These discoveries not only highlight the innovation of the time, but also remind us of the enduring mystery and intrigue of the Cold War's underwater frontier. Whether seen as instruments of conflict or milestones of progress, these underwater relics continue to captivate historians, engineers, and enthusiasts, illustrating humanity's relentless pursuit of dominance and knowledge, even in the most hostile environments. These ocean discoveries illuminate the vast mysteries and untapped knowledge hidden beneath the waves. They showcase scientific progress and remind us of the legends and natural phenomena that continue to captivate human curiosity. If you enjoyed this video or found it insightful, please like, share, e share, as I so, uh, share and subscribe. Stay tuned for more amazing stories in our upcoming videos. See you next time.